This is awesome. <laughs> Carolyn is about to change her name to Super Carolyn when she becomes an incredible pilot. Let's get some speed. 80 miles an hour. Paragliding. Got a super cool pilot here and our big helper tandem instructor here. All good. There we go. No worries. All good. Oh, hey, there we got left. Let's go. Let's oh. do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he wants to go this way first. with that later.
go. Superdell off of a cliff <laughs> where we flew over the ocean uh, along jagged rocks missing trees by inches so we don't do that if you're a beginner that can get ugly because swinging in like that it's very important that you can control altitude that's the same thing as a foot drag see you see me doing foot drags that's the epitome of active piloting and glider control and altitude control when you're dragging your foot same thing as when you're scratching paraglider, trying to match the terrain really close to the terrain. It's very, very important because if you miss and hit the side of that hill, it's going to get really, really ugly really fast. So you have to have extremely good control. It's much, much more difficult and more dangerous than people expect. That's why it's so critical to take super training and absolutely master control the skills before you go fly. So, but then it's fun and it becomes a good experience, and you can swing it in, land wherever you want, piece of cake, control the glider, tandem, no tandem, doesn't matter. Woo, let's do it again.